Hello, and thank you so much uh, for trusting Apex Doma and for purchasing your brand new Powerwall 3. It really is an absolutely fantastic, awesome piece of kit that I'm super excited that you've taken the leap to go and purchase. Um, so this video and the purpose of this video is to tell you a little bit more about all the things that you should expect next, what you're expecting in the little videos that I'm going to go and send over, and essentially what you can do if you have any questions or queries, and all the documentation that you're about to receive, and what it is, and what it does really. Uh, so first things first um feedback uh, we uh, as, as a team we work tirelessly to uh, provide an excellent uh, standard of service and we really hope that you feel the same way about our team and um, if you do feel we've done a fantastic job i would really appreciate you taking the time to drop that feedback online whether that's google whether that's which or whether that's trustpilot whichever your preferred review site is i'd love it if you could give a genuine honest review that would mean all the word to me if you do have any genuine feedback and you think you know what it wasn't quite where i wanted it to be i'd like to hear about it personally my name is Ian Powell, uh, and I'm the managing director of the business. And I'd like you to reach out to me uh, personally, uh, and I'd love to hear your feedback so that we can improve for the future and that we can implement change. I think that's really uh, an important thing to do. So I'd really appreciate if you get in touch if you have any. Um, so first things first is the documentation uh, that you'll be receiving. So there's often a little bit of confusion in terms of when can I get registered for my G99? When can I get my smart export guarantee? Because you've probably got loads of energy being generated on your roof and a little bit's being exported out of the grid after your battery is completely full to grid. So this is for those customers that have got solar and battery storage. I'll refer to just batteries in a second. So firstly, in terms of the actual additional solar generation, our team will be busily working away in the background. We have a full handover process. It's all documented and detailed at our side with boards to be able to track dates. So don't worry, we won't forget about any of the documents that we've got to get sorted. The first thing we're going to do within a couple of days is register you for your MCS certificate. That's a really quick, very straightforward process to be able to undertake. So you'll get an email from the MCS normally within a couple of weeks to be able to confirm the fact that we've registered everything. In the meanwhile, we're going to be preparing things like building control notifications as well again quite a quick process an EIC quite a quick process and if you had solar panels a DC test certificate as well the one thing that does take a little bit of time and is really out of our control is the notification that goes out to the national grid it's called a G99 application so pretty much all the Powerwall 3s that we notify are notified under the G99 application process we apply for permissions in advance for doing this stuff, but when we notify the, uh, the network authority, they do take about 30 days, typically speaking, to write back to us with your DNO acceptance letter. Now, when you apply for Smart Export Guarantee, you're gonna be asked for that MCS certificate, when it's really frustrating when you've got that first number, but you'll also be asked for your DNO acceptance letter, and that is just gonna take a bit of time to come through. It's the nature of the beast, so please be patient. Once you've got those documents and you can upload those two documents to the portal, you can get registered for a standard tariff smart export guarantee now I've done a full video on uh, export tariffs import tariffs and all the things you need to know about the Tesla Powerwall tariffs in a separate video so feel free to have a good watch of that so you can choose the right tariff that would be suitable for you uh, but in terms of smart export guarantee your standard seg payment gets put in at 4p so it is important that you get switched to an alternative rate so you get the maximum in terms of your export when that does happen but please do be aware by the time you get this notification back it can take it say about 30 days typically speaking you can then upload your documents your energy supplier can take a couple of weeks to actually get it registered and get it online and then it might take another week on top of that to be able to move to your export pay your export payments so in my personal uh, in my home that I've just um, I've just had solar panels uh, fitted on that took Pardon me, took about six weeks from start to finish to be able to happen. And I know exactly what I'm doing. I can hit the nail for the first time around. So it's just to manage that expectation. The full handover package will then come over, typically speaking, within about two to three weeks from the team except for the G99 notification that you have to wait a little bit of time for. That's going to detail all the sign-off documents and information that you need to know. Um, should you sell the house in the future? Should you need to reference a part? Should anything happen uh, in the future? You've got all that documentation in one night, neat, nice, neat electronic package. So yeah, I've done a couple of other videos alongside this that you also need to be aware of. I've done a mobile phone app video that's going to show you how you set up your cheap tariff with your power wall, what all the graphs mean and what they do and how you should all expect it to work. So please do take the time to have a good watch of that video as well. Other than that, thank you so much for taking the time to use Apex Domo. We really appreciate your business. And if you have any questions or you feel we're missing anything in this video, reach out. We'd love to uh, hear your feedback. Many thanks.